my iPad. I usually I'm waiting for beta two to come out to yeah. load it on my iPad and then I'll probably go beta three on mm-hmm. the phone. Mm-hmm. One of the things and I don't think it was in the um the keynote. I don't think they covered app thinning, but I think app thinning is gonna be one of the bigger features. Yeah. Especially as we talk. So app thinning is this theory where when you build an app, right? And it's it's for both iPad and and, and phone. That thing where it has you have all the assets. So I have all the assets for the, my iPad on my phone because it, it, it pulled it in, right? So yeah. right. Not only look at that. So there's three different graphic assets. Yep. And there's two different processor assets. Oh geez. Yeah. <laughs> so the X <laughs> the X processors are slightly different than the non X processors. Yeah. 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 So yeah. Thirty two sixty four bit. So and there was one oh, other right, layer. Right. There was one other layer where it was the GPU. Yeah. So hardware that supports metal versus hardware that doesn't support metal also gets a different set of assets. So like legacy older older stuff, like my iPad three here probably has the uses the older assets. Uses the older assets. So So, but all of those assets for all of so two different chip architectures, three different graphic platforms, and two different GPU platforms. (laughs) <laughs> all combined into one giant file, and that's, and that's why, and, and, and that's, that's why Mortal Kombat is a gigabyte. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So now, when you go to post and get a get an app, yeah. it's going to actually only grab the assets it needs on the fly. Yeah. And then pull them down because to that I mean device. that's just a checkbox. It's like okay, you're an iPad three, so you have these graphics, uh, this processor, and what was the other thing? Like, and it's an iPad versus an I- right. iPhone. So, so you check the boxes and you grab those bits of packages, but, right? But you don't have to check the boxes. It, yeah, you I'm saying, show up. I'm saying, I'm saying that yeah, the process on their right. end is they check these boxes here, grab the this 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 and this part off of the shelf and build right. the app. Well, right. what's what's uh, funny to me is that they're doing all of this work to like thin apps and everything. And hey, Apple, just ship bigger phones. <laughs> Stop selling 16 gig iPhones. Or did, or there's still the eights out there. The there's still the eights out there. Yeah, yeah. That, they're doing all of this stuff because they made the silly decision to sell eight gig iPhones. Mm-hmm. Well, and, and look, and the other thing is they they have to figure out they're gonna, still going to support the 4s. Yes. Oh, yeah. All the way, Stop all supporting the, way back, the A5 the, Apple and the iPad. Die. The iPad 2. All the way back yeah. to the iPad 2 and I, the, four, the 4S. I fully believe that they are doing this because they figured out how to make the the A5 oh. is a perfectly good chip for things like mm-hmm. the iPad, the iPod Touch, mm-hmm. and the iPad 2, and the Apple, and the TV. Apple TV. <laughs> and they were like, hey, here's this great general purpose chip. Make it by the billion. <laughs> and they just. <laughs> And they know that they can make it at this like super low cost because they've been making not, it forever. But they're not selling that anymore. They're not but, selling but any. Wait a minute. Yeah, so, so yeah they are only, the fifth yeah. gen iPod Touch, the Apple T, the current yes. gen Apple TV. Oh jeez. All of this stuff is still running the A5. Not not wow. to mention it was only a month ago that they stopped 3GS replacements. Yeah. So you could like, still. Yeah. A month oh ago, man, I've, two I've, months I passed ago, that you, boat, didn't I? <laughs> yeah, you did. You could choo, go. Choo, that thing is gone. <laughs> you could go into the Apple Store and be like, my 3GS broke, and they'd be like, here's a new one. So I mean, they're, if you had like Apple, I uh, exchanged that thing like twice. So I think so, I, I think I'd had my my fill. So here's the the only thing that they that you can do now if you want to be a developer and I guess be a jerk to your customer base, um, you can now set the app targeting to only work on 64 bit devices, which is the iPhone 5s and newer, and the iPad Air, Air and newer. Um, hey. That that's a way to do it. Like there are developers who are just like, can we please just let the A five go, mm-hmm. please, mm-hmm. please, please, please. So because and, that's and, the last right, three and a half. I, inch I kind of agree with them because they they get people that are complaining that their app has poor performance. Did we on have four? Did, did we have the same thing happen between the uh, the uh, 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 old G fives and to the Intel switch? Two, two bits. Mm, or was, sort of. That was more of a compatibility layer, that was, wasn't it? Yeah, that was a compatibility layer called Rosetta. Yeah. And that also had um, the fact that you're running two different instruction sets, PowerPC versus x86. So it's a little more than just a 32 to 64. And the fact that the Intel chips blew the G5 out of the water. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, there's, I mean, there was a number of different reasons there. Yeah. Um, besides the whole. But, but it wouldn't be the first time that they've had a hard line like that. Yeah, I mean, they need, at some they point, they need the to. They Rosetta line forever, though. It did. Yeah. It did. But I, I, at this point, I think that they just need to. I get so sad when somebody brings me a copy of Office, like 
2011 or no not even that probably 20 2007 2008 and 2008 was that, that one yeah. yeah they're like can you put this on this new, brand new mac mini i'm like one no cd drive two no no <laughs> No, just go buy that sweet, sweet Office 365 service. It's a, it's a hundred dollars. It's fine. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. So yeah, they, uh, the, th- that's that. I mean, iOS nine. They did a lot of the same things they did on OS ten. They did. They did. They I mean, made the, the, a lot the, the, of features. Uh, one of the, hey everybody, install iOS nine, and in the right conditions, you'll get an extra hour of battery life. That, that was a that was interesting. So, so they they, they described this as uh, we know when the battery's low and you're trying to switch things off and toggle things off. Well, we have this new mode that turns toggles you didn't know were there. And yeah, you know, uh, and you get an extra hour out of it. What they say? Yeah. That, well, then they have, well, then, then they have.